I've just been informed that the problem of Edgewater has been permanently resolved. You enjoyed this job rather more than I anticipated. You should be proud of yourself, Captain. You're on the verge of making history. There's just one last job I need you to do for me. I've made arrangements for you to journey to the Hope. You will board your former colony ship, reactivate its navigation systems, and skip the colony ship into orbit around Tartarus. Once the Hope is in position, we will have everything we need to begin healing the colony. I have the highest faith in your abilities, Captain. You and I are going to save Halcyon together. Crew members Ellie and Max are engaged in... We have arrived at the Hope. I need you to reroute power from our ship to the Hope's auxiliary generator. You'll have to connect me to the Hope's comm system so I can convince her central computer to enable the skip drive. When I was stranded in Emerald Vale, I simulated a number of hypothetical scenarios in which Edgewater might demise. Death by Automechanical was number 57. Can you hear me, Captain? I have successfully integrated myself into the Hope's comm systems, and am attempting to establish contact with the Hope's more primitive processor now. Would you like me to play a mood-suitable music selection while you travel to the bridge? Oh, sorry. File not found.
the private quarters of the Hope's former crew. Shall we hold a moment of silence for the alien departed? No. That's odd, because my programming was indicating that's the Hope's computer up ahead. I'll admit, I am curious. Greetings, Captain. I am speaking to you through the Hope's computer system. It's a rather cramped feeling, but it'll do. Are you sure? That is extremely dangerous. Skipping the Hope will void the warranty on the skip drive. And also potentially kill an entire planet. How is my humor now, Captain? Improved? Jump starting the skip drive. Destination set to Tartarus. Doing it. I mean, affirmative. Skipping the hope in three, two, one. ADA, does your captain seriously intend to do a micro jump in system with engines that haven't been powered in 70 years on a derelict ship? That is what my captain intends, yes. But that is a gross misuse of the skip drive. The Zero Point Drives Corp and I will not be held responsible for any damage incurred during transport, and this will cause extreme damage. Yes, I am aware of that. You should not be doing this. The humans will die. Thank you, Hope. It looks like all systems are go. Captain, I would advise you to hold on to something, now. Good. We are still alive and have successfully skipped into Tartarus's orbit. The board has initiated contact. I believe they're eager to speak with you once you've returned to the ship. You have a message from Adjutant. Captain, you have an incoming transmission from Tartarus. Attention, Captain of the Unreliable. This is Chairman Rockwell. I'm on Tartarus and, uh, we need your help. Thanks to your intelligence, we successfully captured Phineas, but he's, well, he somehow turned the tables on us. That crackpot scientist has caused a riot among the prisoners and unpaid laborers. It's a law damned bloodbath down here. As if that weren't enough, he's gone and taken Sophia hostage. I'm not gonna mince words. The situation is dire. We... I... need your help. I don't know. They're in the pit somewhere. It's a... Well, you'll see for yourself when you get here. Make haste, Captain. We're losing men by the... Oh, fuck. Fuck! They're at the door! I need to hide! Hurry! Captain, as it appears we may soon be embarking for a maximum security prison planet, 
I believe the crew would like to speak with you to, as you humans put it, air some concerns.